and today's video will discuss about heat transfer before starting the actual heat transfer process we will discuss some of the definitions and applications of heat transfer heat is a form of energy and according to the principle of thermodynamic whenever any physical or chemical transformation occurs heat flow will be there or heat will be leaving the system this heat will have different applications in unit operations and different processes for producing any pharmaceutical dosage form and some of the applications listed here are first is evaporation that is for converting your vehicle that is liquid to a vapor form heat is required that is application of heat is there second distillation for converting liquid mixture and separating that liquid mixture into vapors of individual mixtures heat is again used here for drying that is production of tablets example tablet the solid mass is dried with the help of heat and uh, again you will find we will be finding the use of heat over here that is heat transfer next is crystallization that is saturated solution is converted to super saturated solution for formation of crystals this conversion is applicable only with the application of heat next is sterilization that is uh, it is done with the help of autoclave again autoclave use is done with the help of steam and again steaming steam is used as heating medium over here next is the mechanism of heat transfer three type of mechanisms are there that is conduction convection and radiation okay so conduction is nothing but the passage of heat that is transfer of heat from one atom to the other atom or one momentum to the other momentum okay and convection is nothing but that is mixture of warmer portion of the uh, system to the cooler portion of the system so that the heat transfer is done from one system to the one part to the other part and third is radiation that is transfer mixing of one part with the other part with the help of radiation okay so first is uh, will uh, understand by this uh, example that is no need to write in the exam just for understanding that is okay this is the transfer of one uh, heat from one atom to the other atom that is one atom to the other atom the transfer of heat is taking place in conduction in convection that is mixing of one part with the other part that is uh, warmer portion with the cooler portion and in radiation that is transfer of heat from the one part to the other part is called as radiation okay so let us see about conduction that is when heat flow in a body is achieved by transfer of momentum of individual atoms and molecule without actual mixing that is solid to solid this conduction is seen in solid to solid example steel rod convection when heat flow is achieved by actual mixing of warmer portion to the cooler portion example here we use this for liquid and liquid conduction is used for solid to solid heat transfer convection is used for liquid liquid heat transfer example is steel rod here matlab whenever you heat a steel one end of the steel rod the other end of the steel rod also get heated why because the transfer of heat will take place from one atom to other atom and the heat will be carried to the carried from one part to the other part convection is when heat flow is achieved by mixing of warmer portion to the cooler portion example is whenever you heat a water in a pan you see that the below layer are warmer or hot than the above upper layer so what happens the molecules of the warmer war portion that warmer layer will go and mix with the cooler layer and again the cooler layer also get heated up so this is actual mixing of the cooler one portion with the warmer portion radiation is nothing but your electromagnetic waves uh, and that is electromagnetic waves example is microwave oven that is heat flow occurs with the help of radiations okay for better understanding just a example over here in which all the three systems are acting here one heating coil is present and it is uh, supplying the heat to a, a vessel containing some vehicle or a water here so the heat transfer from the coil to the uh, to the uh, to the this vessel this heat transfer is by radiation and the heat transfer from the vessel to this heating to this uh, holding rod is by conduction and the mixing of warmer portion of the water that is beneath layer with the upper layer is a convection okay so we can see three different type of uh, heat transfers here radiation convection and conduction 
okay so this is about uh, mechanism of heat transfer 